Yardy harmy hearties, and welcome to another pirate survival. So today we're not going to go over this guy. I tried so much to fix him, make him work at all. He's not. He's not gonna work uh, unless the sensors start working like they're supposed to, because they're kind of not doing that. Anyway, we have a guy here, the military ship. I feel like he's heading straight for us. And I fear for my stuff. Uh, so this is something that I kind of don't like with this planet. As you've seen, ships have been spawning really close. Luckily, it's been the weak ships. But if the military ship is going to pass right by, he's going to take out some stuff. Like serious, serious stuff that I don't want to lose. He's going to take out everything. So I'm going to try to intercept him and take, out, take him out first. Yeah, I don't even know if he's actually going to go close enough to my base, but I just it just I just sense it, and you know how I am with the senses, man. I can predict shit. I can predict it all. Not that's not true, but I've I can predict bad stuff happening to me. <laughs> I can do that. Sometimes I do. So rockets, okay. So where is that rocket dot? There it is. Nope, that's so far off. Here. 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 Did I take out? I took out one of them. Where's the other laser? How far off are you? You're not too far off. Flying in closer. I can't see the laser. I can see the laser. Where's it coming from? It's coming from there. Yeah. Did it go? It's gone. No, it's there. No, they're both. They're both still here. I don't have anything. I don't have anything. I. I don't even have a ship anymore. Dang it. It was well armed. A uh, decoy? Can I shove a decoy? Will that help me? Decoy? Where is it? Decoy! Come here. There it is. Build it! There we go! Take out the decoy! Instead of me! We're friendly! <laughs> We're friendly! Okay, I'm definitely in range. Maybe I was able to take out the Gatling turrets on this side. It cost me a ship, though. I'm not sure if the decoy helped me. I'm still uncertain of what the decoy does. I've heard that it tricks enemy ships into thinking that we are allies. If that's the case, I am so happy because this is exactly what I need. So I'm just gonna add this here and leave it here and hope that... Where? That it, all future ships will believe that we are friends and he should not fight me. This is not gonna work. This is scrap, st stupid thing, doesn't want to work. I worked six hours to make you work, you're not gonna work, I've tried it all. Tried it all. All of it. So we're gonna do something else, we're gonna build a new ship. New small ship, need parts, construction components. Okay, so we're gonna build a ship here, and uh, what we, the goal of this ship is to be our worker ship. It's going to be the ship that we use to, uh, for now, disassemble or disassemble the, these guys and build new stuff if we want to. So we need interchangeable tools. So let's start working on a body. And I'm not getting any sounds. Yep, no, that's, that's, there's no placing sound anymore for me. I'm not gonna bother doing anything with that. So we have that. That's going to be our bottom part. Blank. So we're gonna have connectors like these. And they're gonna... And we're gonna pick up stuff using these guys. So there's going to be one s tool set that we have. And that's just gonna click onto the front here. And that's going to be really in the way. No, that's gonna be fine. That'll be fine. Let's hope that will be fine. Mm, perfect. Bots. 
Man, I have welding times two, and it's still taking years and ages. So we need motors. Motors, display, blah, 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 blah. Motors. Mostly motors. You have all the stuff. I can put you over there. Maybe I should just bring these. <laughs> maybe I should just bring these things home. That's already in the inventories. Yeah, maybe I should do that. Not you, though. Ah, I need you, too. You have motors. Ah, scavenging. Mm. Oh, maybe I'd actually, I'd actually want to bring you back a little because I need a connector and then a welder. So they're going to be bumped out like a lot and I might not see what I'm doing. I don't care. I do care. Yep, 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 yep. La da da, la da da. I'm low on power. Antenna? I thought I renamed you to Bob. Bob. There we go, Bob. That's the way. Aha, uh aha, -huh, uh -huh, I like it. Kids, this is when what happens when you don't think before doing stuffs. You have to redo it multiple times. <sighs> Redoing stuff. Conveyor. Okay. Is this the right orientation? Yes, it is indeed. Ah, nice. Nice. So where can I put the connector? Connector. Well, what you don't have in your head, you'll have in your legs. Let's redo this again. I think I want it on the bottom. I think I have a connector on the bottom that I'll replace where I can put the connector on the bottom. That would be really nice. And sometimes you just have to talk in the little Swedish accent. Accent? Accent. Ja, very nice. Ja, mycket fint, mycket fint. Which means very nice, uh, but in Swedish. Perfect. Put that there. And we put connector here. And then we bring the entire thing down. So we can... Uh, yes. Or I put it on the top. Yes, that could also be it. But no, I don't want to change my mind too many times. This will be good. Oh wow, we can do this. One, two, three. <laughs> that's actually pretty cool. Uh, yeah, that's a nice solution. I like that. Whoops. Just, we can have six... Six reactors just plopped onto there, and we'll have one, two, three, one. Yeah, I think that's overkill. I agree with you. This is a little bit of overkill. We don't need that many. <laughs> Mainly because I'm running out of large steel tubes. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, I'm coming to get you. Come here, large steel tubes. So that's... Four up and down, four left and right, six forward. We have no braking power. It's time to sing the welding song. Boom, boom, boom! Weld, 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 Haha! <laughs> Using the jetpack is cheating. We'll start with a gyroscope. And it also needs large steel tubes. That's perfect. I have. We are close to being flyable. It will be glorious. I mean, we don't need the fighter cockpit for this. It doesn't suit the... The job. I mean, it's, it, gi it gives us poor vision below. Put you there, and these guys will start taking, so now I can grab you again. So, the reason I had to do this, place another reactor here, and then remove it, is because the reactors uh, won't grab parts unless they are powered. Uh, or unless there is power in the ship and you can't like like move 
stuff like this, even though it's connected, if you don't have power. So nothing with conveyors will work unless you have power. So if you have hidden reactors like this, and you don't have any power, then you're gonna have to place another reactor down. Let's see, what do we have here? We can fly him! Yes, let's try it! Wee, 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 Wee. One attachment coming up. So, what we'll do is that we'll grab this guy and fly up to this guy. Is my landing gear going to be in the way? Nope. Do that. And they're not able to connect because it doesn't have any power. And we'll put in some uranium there, and they should turn on. So we can do that. There we go, it's not a perfect connection, but there we go. So we'll have that. And it's doing that. Okay, I was scared about that. It is... So if I fly upward, you will see that it's turning as well. That's not me, that's just... It's another ship. Uh, the grinder is another ship, and it's acting like I am carrying another ship. Okay, I was hoping that they would work like the merge block, but the beam above me would go to another grinder that looks just the same, and is in the others on the other side, so we would be able to connect to that as well. Okay, so here we go. Let's try to pick this guy up. We'll turn on our connectors. Fly forward a little bit. Hmm, maybe we'll keep them off for now. Let's see, we're getting close. Yeah, let's turn them on. There we go. They're lining up and blank. Let's lock them. What if we wiggle around? Okay, they're not following every exact movement, but uh, yeah, there we go. Say no, maybe not that guy. It is a little bit wonky to control because of the uh, control unit not being actually part of the ship, but being a secondary ship that we are controlling. It's acting a little bit funky, but we can pick up stuff. We can disassemble. <sighs> and there it's gone. <laughs> ba -ba -da -ba. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. But it is definitely working, and we could just make another one of these attachments, but with welders, and we could use the same ship to weld. It's time to make it pretty. What is, <laughs> why did I make it sound so creepy? I think we will benefit from making this guy really heavy, so I think I'm gonna fill all the gaps with armor. I don't think I'm gonna bother with uh, heavy armor, uh, because it takes ages to uh, weld. For that reason, and that reason only, I'm not gonna bother with heavy armor. And uh, rotating correctly. <laughs> those two things. I'll I'll keep away from those. We are made of metal. Oh, our hearts are made of steel. Dun, dun, dun. Even if we're stained with blood, you know we got that sex appeal. Dun, 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 dun. I think there's something wrong with this, except for this weird shadow. Where it's coming from? Oh, it's our antenna. Except for that, I feel like there's something missing. Instantly, ten times better. Don't worry, we'll do the coloring later. It will come later. And it will be... Muchos fabulosos! Actually, we need a color for a base. Oh my god, that's so neon! I love it, and I'm gonna keep it. Ooh, a little bit of matte in there. Hmm, really nice, really nice. What about this? Nah, that's too bland. Let's copy this. Copy and paste. 
Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah, yeah. Invisible. Yep, invisible part. Invisible part. I believe I can weld. I believe I can build. Don't interrupt me, you computerized voice. I could live here. Oh wait, I do. <laughs> Holy shit, that's my phone. It's too awesome, I can't handle it. I can't handle it. It's just too much. It's too much to handle. I believe this is gonna look cool. Because shapes. You didn't have anything that's you're attached to. Let's fix that. I've uh, went into something I would like to call the silent building mode, where I just kind of shut up and build. Energy low. You evil voice telling me when to stop building. It's beautiful, don't you understand? Ask you evil voice telling me that I need to eat and sleep and recover my energy. I don't have time for your fancy stuff. All I have time for is my art. My art. More art. Art. <laughs> How many steel plates do I have? <laughs> wow. That's... That's knowledge. That's timing or whatever. How many steel plates do I have left? One. That's... I don't even know what that is. That's just madness. It's the senses. I told you I've had the senses to know when something is bad. I guess it wasn't really bad, but it wasn't in my favor either. So, uh, yeah, I am officially clairvoyant. <gasps> Was that the last part that needed to be welded to make it perfect? Oh, and there we go. There now we have the perfect ship. I think that's there's something wrong. There we go. The coloring is off here. There we go. And it also now it maneuvers much much nicer. It's not doing the turning around as much. Uh, we don't have a landing gears. A landing gears. We don't have any landing gears. But I guess we can park via connectors, which I don't like uh, because it's kind of. Wonky. It's weird. Wonky. Uh, anyway, Kennel, we have the ship. It's a ship, and it's working. And we have the angle grinder. It's called angle grinder. Why is it called angle grinders? Is there different kind of grinders? Anyway, we can grind, which is really nice. We can do that. We can start tearing down the ships. These chips can start it being turning, grinding down. We can start grinding down these ships. You can see if we just have the connectors here. We can actually turn them off. Do that. Turn these guys off. We'll just back off a little. And so this is the addition which we can change out. Uh, so if we build another one of these, but with welders, we can have uh, like a second set of these guys. It requires the uh, the reactor so that these connectors will be powered. Um, I don't know if there's any way to work around that, but this is the core guy. Just fly him out a little. We can do this. Flank semi nicely. It's it feels a bit heavy, but I think it should be. It's basically just a big storage right in here. We can do this large cargo container and then we just move stuff over from wherever it seems to be. We don't need to do it from the reactors. Uh, so we have to do some storage management. We have the bottom back part. I think the bottom is the coolest part. Because it has more details. It has this thing, this thing that goes forward. That's kind of these sticky things. It's a little bit messy. Uh, I'm pretty bad at coloring, if I'm gonna be honest. Uh, it's not the, my choice of colors that's bad, <clears throat> necessarily. It's just the way that I color, like, with the different colors. 
Uh, I'm pretty poor at that. Uh, but it's it's a pretty co okay starter ship with modular uh, things. So let's start these guys and see if we can just fly up. Do this without leaving first person. Can do this. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at this. Do that. See, the connectors are uh, close. <gasps> nope. Did not mean to do that. Okay. Fixed itself. Maybe I should put a gyroscope on that guy as well. So it doesn't do this wobble thing. But anyway. Let's just connect. And do a farewell test grind here. We can grab... What do we grab? I mean... I pretty much grabbed everything. So this guy is just... He's down for demolition. He's definitely down for demolition completely by hand. He doesn't have thrusters in all the places. So we'll just start going from up here. There we go. Start the grinding. Do the FK thing. There, there we go. Thank you all for watching. I'm going to start grinding these guys down. I'll make the other thing between episodes, the other uh, module, uh, the other add-on, whatever you want to call it. So, if you have any ideas for a name of this guy, or maybe a color scheme or something that you... Uh, that you'd... If you have any suggestions overall, just leave them in the comment section below, and I'll make sure to the read them. And I shall see you... Hello, next time...